So there are two silver keys in this area, and I think a gnome. What in the world? Are you seeing this? What? This is glitch. Huge graphical glitch right here. Oh, it lo definitely looks like there is that. Ah. It's it's a water rock, maybe? It's a graphical glitch is what it is. Looks neat. <laughs> yeah. I like it. It looks so how, pretty. How, how do we make it not daytime? Um, we just have to come here at a, at, at a different time, basically. Um, it's, it's usually always daytime when you first come here, and then we come here another time. It's not... I see. There's, oh, there's also a book. Uh, once we can get around. So, I, I guess we'll cut here and then, like, pretty much just show the book. And then just Yay, say book. we got those two keys and gnome. <laughs> Yay, book. Book over here. Right on this bench. Baron von Orphan was a dabbler in the black arts, particularly alchemy. As a young nobleman, he applied a sample of his own blood, mixed with various alchemical substances, to a mandrake root, and created a small, diminutive version of himself, a homunculus. It was his dark aim that this creation would become a vessel for any ailment or malady which would otherwise plague the Baron himself. From that day forward, Baron von Orphan suffered no disease, no wound, no wart, nary any affliction at all. Thus it was that the Baron lived well past the age of 80, until one day he accidentally knocked the homunculus into an alembic of powerful acid. There it promptly dissolved, and the horrified Baron, seeing this, steeled himself for the worst. But was fine. Turns out he just had a really amazing constitution. Uh. <laughs> this is nice. one of the few golden doors that we do want to open. Got it. I forgot about this one. I got it. I did it. Yes, very good. Thank you. There's a chest. <laughs> if you could pat me on the head, you would. I would. <laughs> Did, I did it. I, I did it. I got a hammer. I don't like hammers. I like hammers. <laughs> yeah, I know. You're a fan of hammers. Check, I don't this, want it. check this out. Bam! Hammer. <laughs> Whatever. It's not a hammer. <laughs> what kind of hammer did you get? Uh, one that had. The uh, one? Uh, oh, uh, man. No, it, it had a handle. And then oh. at the end of the handle, it had a I... giant thing of, like, metal that was all hammer-like. That's the one. Honestly, I don't, I don't remember what it was called. Something like Sorrow's Fist or something? Dead people can't shoot guns. I think it's a rule somewhere. Here's the... one of the keys. Yay, key. Yes, dog. Treasure. Very good. Thank you. Jeez. <laughs> so much treasure! I totally forgot that there was a gold door here. And I can help you this place is just a there. treasure trove. That one? Pull your head out your ass! Dogs are noble, loyal, and faithful. All right now, this time game. I'm going to shoot him in the face. You're not going to. I'm gonna. Nope. It's not gonna happen. Excuse me. It's not. Have you got the time to get? Son of a biscuit game. <laughs> it's not gonna happen. <laughs> What's the point of manually aiming if you always shoot him in the gut? It's an auto aim because this game is usually made for a controller. Boo. If you just have the cursor kind of on him, it will auto-target to a very particular point on his body. But it's like I'm I'm manually aiming and zooming in. Yes. It's still not matter. Uh, now where's the other key? I think it might have been on the other side of this gate. You know what else is on the other side of this gate? Gravity Grass. <laughs> Uh, Demon door. Uh, that's the same one. Yeah. We're just going backwards now. 
No, not, not this way. Eh, eh, eh don't, don't eat me ground. Don't eat me ground. I can never find all of these things and like... Dude, that rock has someone's face. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Yeah. You gotta stand where I'm standing and then stare at the rock that I'm like facing. Looks like someone's like looking down at you all pompously. Doesn't it? Which one? Alright, stand right there, right? Mm -hmm. Alright. Look at this rock up here. Mm -hmm. It looks like he's kind of frowning and like one of those people that's looking down at you, like, th like tilting their head up but looking down at you. Like, oh, it's one of you people. Dude, I totally, totally... You know what, I'm gonna screen capture this just, just in case you don't get to see it. I'm totally gonna screen capture this, and then I'm gonna, like, circle it and point out the features, because that's amazing. I, I think they did that on purpose. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go continue looking for that silver key that is somewhere it might be actually like past the demon door I think that's what got me the last few times where it's like it's next to the demon door it's just mm -hmm. in a weird yeah I f f it's here I found it <laughs> Woo! there we go I'm totally gonna later on I'm gonna like point out the face you're gonna be like you, oh my god have to send it to me. <laughs> it's a face it's amazing if you could I will. If you would, send me um, both the uh, original and the one you circled. And then you'll try and find it first? N no, or, I, or just, I might actually okay. be able to, like, maybe put sure. some, like, uh, animation to it or something like that. I will definitely do that. And then everyone who watches this LP, you will be like, oh my god, the creators of this game are genius! <laughs> There's so many layers to this game. And then, like, the creators themselves like, dude, I was just, just a rock. It's a rock. <laughs> <laughs> it's like when I made that one time I made toast, and I found Jesus on it. 